Hello folks, I am trying something new here. Uh, my targets have gone um, to a point where I can no longer see them, but the moon is out. And so I'm going to, I'm trying to see if I can actually capture the moon with my ASI 1600. And what I, what I did in Sequence Generator Pro is uh, the moon was right near the star Regulus, so I actually played solved on Regulus, and I got close enough to the moon so where I could kind of center it. Now I'm actually in nebulosity with the frame and focus so I can see this in real time. Um, I'm not um, using PhD2 right now. There's, there's no guiding going on. So I, it looks like I, uh, I, I'm just not sure if I'm in focus right there. This is the frame and focus. I'm going to stop this. I'm actually on my HA filter right now. Doing uh, The duration is 0 0.01. That seems to be okay for that. That was just a wild guess. I left the gain at 139.21. But does it look like it's in focus? Let's do a preview. And see what this looks like. Now, where did the moon go? That's some... I have no idea what I'm doing here. So that's what the moon looks like right there. Let me get this. And I'm not sure I'm in focus. Maybe I gotta play with the focus a little bit more. But let's just try this. I'm not going outside to do this. It's it's zero degrees right now, Fahrenheit. I'm gonna put this back on frame and focus. Okay, let's zoom in again. And let's try the focus of 6950. 6950 up there. And let's go to that focus point. I just increased it by 50. Ooh, that was a little bit sharper. I could tell already. I'm going to go a little bit more. Let's try 6975. Hmm. Hard to tell. How about 7,000? Let's see if that's too high. Go to... I can't tell with this, and I'm doing a remote connection. I can't really tell if I'm in focus. I'm going to go back to 6950. Okay, well, what I'm going to do is, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going I'm to try and do a single shot again. Abort the frame and focus. Now I want to do, let's see, I'm going to capture, let's see, five pictures. Where are they going at, anyway? I'll create a new folder here. I'll call it Moon. I haven't used Nebulosity in a long time. I'll say select this. Let's just say capture five pictures. It's capturing. Okay, finished. So I want to download them to my main computer. We'll see how they turned out. I'll see you later. Okay, so I downloaded the image to my main computer, and that's what that's what it looked like. And then I did a little processing in PixInsight and Photoshop, and that's let me zoom in on this one a little more. And that's uh, come on, where are you? That's not too bad, actually. For my first attempt with this camera at capturing the moon, I remember doing this way back when with my DSLR. I never tried it with my mono camera before. And it looks pretty good. And if I keep it at a distance, 
Um, if I zoom in, then you can start to see how grainy it is when it's at 100%. Maybe it's not in focus as good as it could have been. Not really sure. I guess I'd have to play around with the focus a little bit more. But if I just kept it like that, that's not too bad. It was kind of fun to play around with anyway. So, anyway, thanks for listening. It was just kind of a fun exercise. I'll see you later. Oh.